the Thin Mints Bandit who stole 18 boxes of the popular uh, cookie from a local Girl Scout troop. But it's what the community did to help that troop that surprised these folks. Eileen Park shows you. Jessica Fox Hawney had only one question on her mind. Who would steal from children? After a busy day Saturday of selling Girl Scout cookies, Jessica and her daughters came back home and left 18 boxes of Thin Mints in the car. I closed it, locked it, shut my garage, but then my daughter came back out later that night. She came back out and unlocked the car and never locked it. So sometime that night, Jessica says someone stole all the cookies. It's just so low to steal from kids. So she went on Facebook and vented on her private page. That was kind of my vent, and then it turned into this, like, huge community support. And I'm like, okay, now I want to cry because, like, you guys are the best. How much is there? As a third grade teacher in Newburgh, she has a lot of parents who are friends with her on Facebook, and many of them reached out. At least 25 people were like, we'll buy two boxes, we'll buy five, we'll buy four. I'm like, thank you all, but <laughs> it was only 18, but thank you. <laughs> her disappointment turned into hope, a little bit of hope for humanity. Now Jessica's daughter learned a valuable lesson. Never leave the car unlocked. In Dundee, I'm Ali Park for Coin Six News.